Hello, welcome to my wealthy lifestyle. Hope all is well with you and your family. Um, tonight, the Holy Spirit downloaded a message in my spirit. When things look as though it is lost, when things look like there there's no there's no life in it. That's what God brings. He brings it back to life. Whatever is dead, he'll bring it back to life. For instance, when you are going through uh, your trials and your tribulations, whatever they may be, you are, you feel like you are in a dead state. And you, most of the time you feel like there's no help. There's no resurrection in the situation. But God always, he always bring it back to life. He always bring it back to life. When hope seems like there's no hope. When it seems like there's no hope. God is the hope that keeps us alive. And without him, there is no hope. Parents, if you have your children and your children are just, you, you can't speak to them, you don't know what to say, or sometimes you say things that it seems like it makes things go even deeper in the, in, in the opposite direction. But where there seems there is no life, prayer, prayer, prayer will keep it alive. Prayer will allow what's dead to come back alive. If you're truly a prayer warrior, somebody prayed for me. Somebody prayed for me. I've been through a lot in my life. I've been through a lot. But somebody was praying for me. Somebody was praying for me. I've been through a lot. And if I would tell some of you some of the stuff that I had to endure, you wouldn't believe it. God will choose a person that seems like there's no hope for them. God will choose them. When you think everything is lost, trust in God. Trust in God. God will bring it back to life. He's the only one that can bring it back to life. I stand in the gap for my children. I stand in the gap for other people's children. The reason why things is going to manifest in my children's life and for my family is because the heart that I have for other people's children. I stand in the gap for my family. I stand in the gap for my children. When all seems lost, that's when God comes back. Oh, Jesus, God comes back and pull it in. When you think that there is no hope for a person, that's when God comes in and pull it, pull them back in. I stand in the gap, not for just my children, but for all children. Let me bow my head in prayer right now. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I thank you, Lord, for a day that I hadn't seen before. 
I thank you, Lord, for your grace and your mercy. I thank you for your unconditional love. And Lord God, I thank you for sending your son Jesus to the cross for everything that I could possibly face in this life, Lord. And I thank you, Lord, for allowing your only son to bear the cross, Father God, in the name of Jesus. I ask that you forgive me for all of my sins, Lord God. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I ask you right now, whatever parent is going through a hardship, that they seem like there is no hope for their children. Lord God, I ask you in the name of Jesus to have mercy upon the family, have mercy upon the children because the children know not what they do because if they did, they would do better. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I ask in the name of Jesus that you save the children, Lord God, that are lost. Save them, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Father God, don't allow any hurt, harm, or danger to come to the ones that are lost. Lord God, I ask that you have mercy upon their souls, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord, I praise you. Hallelujah, Lord, I glorify you, Lord, because you are the great I am. You are the beginning and the end, Lord God. And Father God, you are the only one that can save the unsaved. You are the only one that can heal all sickness and disease. You are the only one, Lord, that can manifest a breakthrough in a twinkling of an eye. And Father God, in the name of Jesus, I ask of you, Lord, to save the children, Father. Give the parents, give the parents the right spirit to deal with their children, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, there is no other name greater than the name Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord, I praise you, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord, I glorify you, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord God. Hallelujah. Father God, in the name of Jesus, have mercy, Lord God. I ask that you protect all children from all hurt, harm, and danger. Not just mine, but all children, Father. Father God, give them the spirit to seek you in spirit and in truth, Father. In the name of Jesus. Father God, open blind eyes, Lord God. In deep, deaf ears, in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord, hallelujah. Father God, I magnify you with my life, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, for all that you do, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for all that you do, Lord, because you don't have to do anything for us, Lord God. Father God, give the parents strength, Father, in the name of Jesus, for their children, Lord God, because everything bad, everything bad, you can reverse it and allow it to become something good. You are the only one that has the power to do all of those things, Father. Father God, I give you honor, I give you glory, I give you praise, because praise is is. is it's all I can do, Lord God, in the name of Jesus. By the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, with the crucifixion upon the cross, with the resurrection upon the third day with your Son, Jesus, who reigns forevermore, who has all power, all power, all power in your hands, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord. I praise you, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen, amen, and amen. Thank you for watching.